This is Lola Lee T. Hey everyone, how are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel. So Krishan's new man, K Suave, reached out to me after he watched my video right here. Title was Krishan's new boo. K Suave has been claimed by another woman. We need answers. And I just wanted to say that I believe every word that he said. So I'm going to show you guys the um, clips that he sent to me. And like, I didn't try changing my number like three different times. And I don't know how, but she finds out how to get my number. And it's scary. She didn't found out my address like a few different times. Like, and it's scary, but... Um, Nothing to worry about. The bitch never really, excuse my language, she never really caused any, like, harm or actual threat. But it's annoying. And the fact that she's 36 years old, acting like a kid and a child, and it's just, like, it's, it's messed up. Her uh, brother, her, uh, like, brothers or whatever, they contacted me before and was apologizing and just saying, like, yeah, like, she's, like, messed up in the head and everything, though. But the whole, like, she literally just texts my phone, like, I don't, she, and I don't block all her numbers, she didn't, I don't block, like, 17 different numbers, but she literally texts me, like, 24-7, like, I have so many text messages with her, like, conversating by herself, like, I have over, like, 2,000, 2,500. So, I just watched, um, your full video about the stalker girl, um, she's so weird, and it's just sad that the bitch is, like, like I said, 36 now. She she literally said she would stop harassing me and calling me and texting me if I apologized to her for exposing. Because the message I sent you, the screen recording of all the text messages, I posted it on my story. And then I went live and I was talking about the situation. So she like, if you apologize to me, I'll stop. And I apologized. So she can leave me alone and stop finding my fucking number every time I change it. And obviously she took a recording of it and I didn't know. But yeah, so that's how that went. And the bitch said it like four different times. So I apologize four different times. And I'm a goofball for even believing it. But yeah, so she's weird for doing that. But all of my fans, supporters, followers already know about Shorty. You feel me? Like. This is something old, like, they was there when she first got bought up, you feel me, like, versus the new people that's coming in that don't know the situation. So I, f I feel that, you feel me, like, I feel uh, being curious and everything, but she's just mentally ill, like, and wants attention, and you posting her is what she's, well, like, she literally texted me from a different iCloud that I done blocked, like, the third one today. She said, bitch, we all about to be famous, LOL. Like, you feel me? That's all she care about, like, you feel me? So, like, she's literally on that and will say anything. At one point, she was commenting on these people's pages saying that I'm her baby's daddy, saying that we got a kid. That was the crazy shit. I had hella people texting my phone, like, yo, who is this? Like, and, but they seen the messages, so then it was like, okay, you know, this bitch is crazy. And Prashan already knows about this girl. You feel me? We talked about it and laughed about the situation already. And she was with me one time when the crazy stalker girl started blowing up my phone. You feel me? Like, knows about the situation. She literally just wants attention. She's no threat at all. Zero threat at all. Trust me. No threat. Just wants attention. Like, like I said, the girl is 36 years old. Like, acting like this she just she wants attention and like i said posting that video trying to figure out who she is that's exactly what she wants no threat at all just a grown-ass woman that wants attention want to be important want to be known mental illness is real so that's the last thing now but um you have a good night slash morning um bye I'm like i didn't try changing my number like so I just wanted to let you guys know that I posted his reply to me with his permission. And I wanted to do that so that other bloggers would be aware of the situation before it gets out of hand. So this will be the last time that I will be posting about this person.
that K Suave says has been stalking him. So thank you so much, K Suave, for giving us the answers that we were asking for. Let me know your thoughts, guys. And then in this one, he's basically showing me what he has been dealing with. Sean already knows about this girl. You feel me? We talked about it and laughed about the situation already. And she was with me one time when the crazy stalker girl started blowing up my phone. You feel me? Like, knows about the situation. She literally just wants attention. She's no threat at all. Zero threat at all. Trust me. No threat. Just wants attention. Like, like I said, the girl is 36 years old. Like, acting like this. She just, she wants attention. And like I said, posting that video, trying to figure out who she is. That's exactly what she wants. No threat at all. Just a grown ass woman that wants attention, want to be important, want to be known. Mental illness is real. So that's the last thing now. But, um, you have a good night slash morning. Um, bye. I'm like, I didn't try changing my number. Like, Thank you so very much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And if you have any hot tea for me, message me on Instagram. I love you guys. Bye. Bye.